hell is a place within my chest? Sorry. Uh, unprocessed. Sacrifice me. Unprocessed were their album from last year, which was And Everything In Between, the name of that album, was my sixth favorite album of last year, which doesn't sound great. You know, it's not like you don't really gloat about a sixth place. Oh, I won sixth place. Like your dad would slap you in the face. Like, I didn't go home to your dad and be like, Daddy, I won sixth. Like, shut up, son. You're a failure. But sixth place, considering the year that we had last year with album releases, Unprocessed being in sixth is a massive, like, I think that's a big deal. I did my top 10 list last year and Unprocessed's album came sixth. And again, it was fucking stacked last year. Invent Anime, Polaris, Currents, uh, Night Versus, Sleep Token, fucking you name i probably missed about a million different albums there but like they came sixth for good reason there was a lot of other albums that i checked out that year and yeah anyway regardless sixth is a very commendable place i fucking love that album it really shocked me um and they are back from two days ago with a track called sacrifice me and um, i actually met the lads from unprocessed when they came to ireland last year or this year i don't even know was it last year or this year Holy shit, I actually can't remember. If it was last year, that's concerning because that was over eight months ago. But anyway, no, I think it was the start of this year. Anyway, I met the lads. Very, very, very cool blokes uh, from my brief conversations with them. Uh, they came to Dublin with Tesseract. I don't even know if I mentioned that or not. Did I? I don't know. I've brain rot. Anyway, this is their new track. Very excited to check this out. I'm just looking forward to some fucking stupidly technical riffs. Some beautiful choruses and just some overall creative music that makes you makes you ponder why you ever even bother picking up a guitar again so uh without any further ado unprocessed sacrifice me let's go my fucking hair is shit All a very real percussive feeling riff or lick. I love already, man. Alright, I'm bringing it back. Manuel is the perfect example of proof that God has its favorites, alright? God has his favorites. Manuel, he's probably watching this right now. I know he's probably watching this, Manuel. What's up, brother? I'm sorry. Look, the glaze is real right now, but there, God has his fucking favorites and he is living proof, okay? Oh! It's the expression in all of the words. There's so much character in every fucking syllable. Relatively tame so far for an unprocessed track. Still fucking gorgeous though, man.
Uy. The only time I've heard a breakdown like that is in the uh, Disembodied Tyrants track from the start of this year, off of that new EP. I love their fucking overall production tone. Everything sounds so raw. There's the chills. There they are. Jeez, man. Video is sick as well. The video looks like all of the city shots look like um the fucking like world that Coffeezilla has built in all of his uh his sets. If you guys know the YouTuber Coffeezilla, but anyway, that was unprocessed. Sacrifice me. Who are back after? their album which was extremely successful yeah, last year i think uh, they won over a lot of new fans with the album last year and then obviously you know them touring with tesseract and um, on their european tour was obviously a big deal for them as well but man these guys are so fucking good i mean the name unprocessed really rings through on i guess i'm like not too versed in their full discography but their last album was very similar from a production standpoint to this and the overall soundscapes but it's like not so much on the clean vocals because I think the clean vocals sound so well polished but the unprocessed name I think really rings through on the likes of the you know the the fucking meteor guitar tone and also the uh the harsher vocals from Manuel like they're very very unprocessed they're very very raw sounding which I think I remember when I checked out the album last year it obviously had a lot of albums that came out last year up until that point because their, their album last year was a late release this is a pretty early single to be dropping for I, I guess maybe another album cycle I don't know maybe it's just a standalone single maybe it'll be a part of a bigger project but um I remember at the time there had obviously been a lot of albums like we look at the likes of Sleep Token which was my number one album last year um that was obviously very very produced and a lot of like I guess auto-tune using vocals and just very well polished like fucking phenomenal modern metal production but then on process came around with their album and the fucking songwriting was fantastic the melodies are absolutely gorgeous but it also had that like raw feel to it overall so i think that's like one of the standouts i mean there's a lot of standouts to take away from this from a technical standpoint from a guitar player standpoint uh, this isn't like the most technical stuff now take that with a pinch of salt because i know this stuff is still really really fucking technical in parts but obviously compared to what unprocessed are capable of it's you know a pretty tame song and uh, it feels like more of a, an emotional, like euphoric track. So absolutely fucking gorgeous as always. This is going to be on repeat for me. I'm fucking delighted, man. This is two tracks in a row. It's been a while since I've done like two back-to-back -back reactions where I've actually really enjoyed the track. The Make Them Suffer track was pretty sick. But to me, this is way more up my street than, you know, Make Them Suffer's track. You know, all respect to Make Them Suffer. But this is just what I'm feeling a lot more at the moment. It's just fucking beautiful it takes it incorporates all of the things i love about metal with like the you know low tune guitars the technical riffing but also just makes it a very listenable emotional song and um, so yeah fantastic as always again i'm straying away from doing the ratings thing so just let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below guys i'd love to hear what you have to say do you like it is this a new is this your first time hearing on process if you haven't heard them already highly suggest you go and check them out obviously the likes of tesseract was always a band that I was told about when people were trying to get me to check this band out. I, I get it because obviously there's like genty fucking rhythms and shit, but I think this band is really like creating their own sound at this moment. Obviously there's a Polyphia comparison there as well, but I just don't really hear Polyphia because obviously there's beautiful vocals in this and, and Manuel's really, really like making the band stand out in that regard. Not only is he very fucking talented on the guitar, obviously shout out to Dave and the rest of the lads in the band, all very fucking technical. But um, yeah, the vocals are absolutely phenomenal as well. And then the ability to play some of these fucking riffs whilst also singing and screaming is just, it's mental. But anyway, that's, that's enough glazing for today. 
I am signing out. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy it, leave a like in the video. It would be much appreciated. That's all for me. Look after yourselves. See you in the next one. Cheers.